All right, so in this video, I'm gonna quickly walk you guys through the process of how you could find a company's website from simply just having the company name. So we run into this situation pretty often at Leaper. We'll have clients that give us a list of company names that they wanna target, and we'll simply only have the company names. And they want us to go identify the decision makers. So let me walk you through the process. Super simple, requires a little bit of coding, but it's really just copy and pasting from what will be in the description of this video. So the first thing you wanna do is install Clearbit's free API script. And I'm gonna leave that in the description below. But basically this script is tapping into Clearbit's API for free to convert a company name into a website name. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that really quickly. I'm just gonna copy it and I'll show you how to add into a spreadsheet as well. So you just need to come into extensions, click app scripts, it's gonna open it up. Just clear everything in here and then just click and paste the code into there. Click save. And now what you can do is head over into step two where you will now take this formula to enrich the company names that you have. So I have a couple of company names right here and I am just gonna add the cell number, so A2. And it's gonna go and identify what the website is. And just to show you guys that this works, we're gonna go ahead and bring it down all the way. Uh, and you'll see that it's identifying the, the website of these company names. So one thing to kind of keep in mind is if you have a ton of companies that have similar names or, you know, like for example, in this, this right here, like my main domain is Leaper.io, it's not Leaper.com, but there's multiple Leapers. There's a Leaper.com, Leaper.co, a Leaper.io. We're all separate organizations. And so sometimes this Clearbit API might identify, you know, someone that isn't relevant to it, but, you know, in most cases, it's probably gonna be less than one or 2% of your total list. Um, so that's how you would go in to find the domain and then you just want to apply it, your list of company names to enrich with company websites just by scrolling it all the way down. And now what you can do is save this CSV and come into Apollo and do the function of importing the company website URLs into Apollo. So you simply want to click search, hit companies, click import, and then click bulk import from CSV and then add your CSV into there. And all you're going to do is match the website domains that you've gotten from Clearbit's API that we just did together. And you're gonna match it with Apollo's account website filter and import the list in. And basically what you're telling Apollo is, hey, go find everybody that works at a company with this domain, right? And then you could be an Apollo and filter for the decision makers that are relevant to what you sell. And so that's the entire process, a very simple thing to do. You just need to tap into Clearbit's API and you will be able to leverage that to go identify the proper decision makers by identifying the website. Very simple process. Let me know, and hopefully this helps. Um, and yeah, maybe if you guys have any questions.